welcome to Jen's Hangout or welcome back if you are returning. I am so glad that you are here. Today we are doing a collab. Oh, yes ma'am. We are doing a collab. Oh boy. Are we doing a collab? This collab is going to be a fun one. You're going to watch your girl go through some pain. Oh, are we going to go through some pain? Okay, so what is this collab? This collab is hosted by Miss Barbara's Beauty Bag. Um, uh, The playlist will be linked down below as per the norm. You guys are getting used to this, I'm sure. Anyway, um, so it will be as follows. This is our favorite lippies also featuring our jeffree star collection so but this is our favorite lippies and um we will be swatching them on our lips oh yes and it's pucker up bitches bring it on so i have a wet makeup eraser some um makeup removing balm and a dry cloth to help ease the pain of the separation <laughs> anyway and then i have a, a plethora of my lippy collection here and as you guys know i have a lot of lippies and i do mean a lot like that's that's my jam right there like that's my jam oh my neck is not doing well anyway so like i have the vaults three of them um of several max you, you know gerard cosmetics curse cosmetics lots of indie brands i love indie brand lippies um that's kind of what a lot of indie brands specialize in and as you guys know that's my passion is indie brands so i have a lot of those but anyways so let's get into some of my favorite lippies we are going to start not with jeffree star why? Because Jeffree Star is the biggest and I don't feel like burning my lips off just yet. What are we going to start with? We're going to start with the most affordable. What's the most affordable, you say? Well, what's better than a buck, right? Okay, I love Shop Miss A. You guys know that. So, Shop Miss A has some absolutely banging i mean like i have some of their bullet lipsticks in here somewhere uh, the rainbow. at least i thought i did maybe i got rid of them finally that's l'oreal Ooh, maybe i did i must have because that's wet in a while so i must have okay but i have their lip glosses and then i have their velvet lips and then I have some of their matte lips, right? Okay, and then their lip glosses are dupes for a lot of Jeffree Star's lip glosses. And then their velvet lips and their matte lips are on freaking point. Let me tell you. Okay, so we're going to start with the one that's open. Okay, so this is a velvet matte lip no yes no this is a wonder matte lipstick sorry and this is in the shade venus 2039 like i said these are a buck they don't really have a smell like at all okay They go on so smooth. 
I think they have castor oil in them because they kind of have that castor oil smell to them. But there you go. That's what she looks like. So pucker her up a buttercup. Anyway, that's what it looks like. Um, I'm going to go ahead and show you some lip glosses over this one. Because the dry down on these are phenomenal. Like, okay. They have a dupe for the Fenty Gloss Balm. The Diamond Milk one. Like, this is a dupe for the Diamond Milk. I have the Diamond Milk and it's okay. It's very gloopy and very sticky. Theirs are not. They're wonderful. Remember, always wipe your lip gloss off. Be kind and don't stick it in there and ruin your lip gloss. Right? With a funky color. Okay, so. They're not gritty. Or grimy. They're just a wonderful color. And they have such a beautiful shine. Right? Perfect amount of gloss without being gloopy. I mean, yeah, they don't necessarily taste like cherries or cake or, you know, something like that. They don't have a taste. The glosses don't. Um, but they're just, they're gorgeous. I mean, that is stunning. Right? And it's an exact dupe for the diamond milk. So, there's that one. There is that one. I haven't even opened this one. This one's really pretty. Okay, so. Wear wipe. If you put them on. Oh boy. If you put them on and then put a gloss over them, it's not quite so bad. But dang, are my lips going to be mad. Okay, so this one's in the shade Hard Candy. This is a gloss. Gloss, gloss, gloss. But I am going to show you it over. This one is a matte in the shade Serenity. Told you I have a lot of lippies. Gotta get them open. I have so many. So many. But I do love them. They're gorgeous. Hold on. Okay. So, like I said, this is uh, the matte, the Wonder Matte Lipstick. In the shade Serenity. It is really pretty. It is beautiful. And then this is the shade Hard Candy in their gloss, which is the Diamond Lip Gloss. They're so pretty. They really, really are. I love them. And they're not sticky, they're not gloopy, they're just comfortable to wear. Beautiful orangey coral shades. Beautiful. They, those go really good together. <laughs> I will have to remember that. Okay. Oh, Lordy. Okay. 
I'm going to get this off my lips and we shall be right back. Okay. So I don't have anything on my lip right now. This is the gloss in the shade Bubblegum. Caro Lavender shade. Thought I would just show you it on bare lips. Because sometimes you just want some gloss. There you go. That's what that looks like. And then this is a dupe for the Lord Gloss. They're very similar. And I'll put this one on here shortly. So you can see what I'm talking about. Lip glosses are so much easier to take off. Hmm. I love this one. This one's one of my favorite. Favorites it has kind of a blue shift. Beautiful. They're pretty. And then no white. There we go. Okay. So this one, this purple one is called Gypsy. This one is Girl Power. This one is just your standard pinky gloss with the pinky shift. So there's that one. Mmm. And then we have a goldy one. This one's called Glitz. What do I do look like? Need to open that one. And then, and then, and then, and then, there's so many. I literally have every shade they have, but I gotta get them open. Okay, so this one is called Glacier. That's what that looks like. It's a blue. It's a really pretty one. It looks stunning over a black lip or dark purple. You can kind of see it in the... Okay, this one is called Mermaid. It's a green. I had Pixie somewhere, I thought. This one, I think, is probably one of the most pigmented ones. Again, these look fantastic over a darker lip. You can kind of see what I'm talking about. Um, I'm trying to go zoom me fast. I'm at 14 minutes already. This is going to be a long freaking video. Okay, so they have another color called Posh. I don't have that one open yet, so I'm not going to show you. Um, this one's called Cosmic. It's kind of a purpley pink. It's really pretty. I really enjoy this one. It's really pretty. This one's probably my favorite. By far. Okay, that's all the glouses, all the glouses, but now we have the velvet lips. I'm going to show you my two favorite colors of the velvet lips, which are, and these are amazing formula. Okay, so the, this is Lana, 
They have some fantastic nudes. I like the mauves. And the dark cherry colors. There's the doe foot. There's the colors. And that is what it looks like. I love it. And it dries down to a comfortable mat. It's not like, oh my god, my lips are going to fall off my face. No, it's not like that. Okay. Okay, and then this one, one of my faves. This is Luma. It's a very gorgeous cherry color. Dark cherry color. I'm going super fast for this stuff. As you can see, it does not go on blotchy or anything like that. Normally I would be way more careful than this. There you go. That's what that one looks like. Okay, I'll be right back. I'm going to get this off of my lips. The cool thing about those velvet lips is they dry down and then they fade down to a really beautiful lip stain. I love them. Um, they're gorgeous. And then for only a buck, they're fabulous. Okay, the, this is my second favorite brand of lips. This is a lip stain. It is an actual stain. Um, this is Tony Moly Perfect Lips Shocking Lip. And this is in the shade Petal Shocking. Um, I also have the shade Thunderbolt and the shade Hot Taste. These are gorgeous reds, pinky reds, and an orange. These are the type of lip stains that it doesn't matter if, I mean, if you haven't exfoliated your lips, you're okay. Um, they don't, they don't feel like you're going to, um, they're, they're, they don't take forever to dry down. They don't get on your teeth they fade down beautifully throughout the day and they are a real lip stain they're gorgeous i love them see what i mean so give me a minute see what i mean by lip stain 30 seconds on the lips and it won't come off anyway so i'm gonna do a few jeffries for you and then I'm done. A um, couple of my favorites of Jeffrey's. And then and then it will be done. Sorry, it is taking me so long. So this is Ryland from the Shane collection. I'm sure you guys all know which one I'm talking about. Hey, at least it covered up the redness. I really like this one just kind of, I don't know, it's like a 80s flashback. Reminds me of 
Um, but anyways, I really enjoy it. And hey, it tastes like root beer. Right? And who doesn't like root beer? Well, no, lots of people don't like root beer. But, you know, hey. Okay, so this one is Candy Ass. And I really love this one. This is kind of one of my go-tos. I really enjoy this one. I think this one's in my red vault down here. It's just like the perfect little your lips but better with a little frost. It's kind of where it sits. That's what that one looks like over the red. So, mm. getting raw now. Okay, so this is one of the Christmas exclusives. So it's just a little stocking, but it reminds me a lot of poinsettia and I love it. It is a gorgeous red shimmer. So pretty. So, so pretty. Okay, so that's what that one is. And those are a couple of my favorites of that. Ugh. It's a bomb. Ooh. Here we go. Much better. Okay, if you're wondering what balm i'm using it is the body shops chamomile sumptuous cleansing butter it's for sensitive skin and it works really good okay my all-time favorite of his ever is um i'm vulgar you you can get it in the um queen bitch vault or you can just get a big one I have yet to buy a big one. I figured, let me finish up this one first. Oh, she's smearing on my face now. But I love this one. Some of these are getting pretty dried up. But I absolutely adore this one. She's so pretty. She's this gorgeous purpley with a sheen. So gorgeous, right? It's just like the perfect the perfect color and then berries on ice again another perfect little this is a matte it goes on a little patchy though you will say that Okay. You get the idea. Hi, beautiful. And then you put a little clout over the top of it, and it's even prettier. Which is, this is clout. See? Makes it even prettier. So, okay, so that's 
from that vault. I'll be right back. Okay. So now we are in the Love Me, Love Me Not vault. And Calabasas, of course. Probably is going to look about the same with that lip stain on. It's a really just wonderful red. Thank you, red color. Um, <clears throat> oh, she's getting everywhere now. <laughs> oh yeah she getting everywhere now the makeup is shot it's okay and then for a really good red we have red rum right Oh yeah, I'm getting it everywhere now. Everywhere we go. Oh yeah, you get the idea. <laughs> but red rum is a great red for a matte red. It really is. I mean, it's similar to Date Night from Dose of Colors, which is a good red. Which I also have. Anyway, so that's from the red vault. Now we are on to the nudes. Woohoo! Okay, there's really only a couple in here that I really like. Okay, so we got Rose Matter, which I is kind of like a pinky nude. Which you really can't tell on my lips. But it is, it is your lips, but better. That's what that color is. Right. Okay, three more and then, yeah, and then we're done. Okay, so this is Leo. This is a fantastic brown nude. Actually, no, I still have to do my glosses. Dang it. Okay. We're going to put glosses over Leo. Okay. We're going to start with the new glosses. We're going to do this lightning fast, though, because I have eight of these suckers. Eight. Count them. Eight. I have eight. Okay, so I have this one. This is Tabletop. Which is, it's not a, like a matte. Actually, no, we're going to start with this one. Because this one is a matte. This is silk robe. This is just this. Right? It's just a gloss. It's a brown gloss. That's all it is. Brown gloss. So if you don't want clear, you want brown, there you go. Right? There she blows. That's that one. Okay. Then you want a little hint of sparkle, but don't want a lot, right? Then we have tabletop. And y'all yeah, are layering it on. There you go. That's that one. Okay. You want to go a little bit more, but still not a lot, right? Then we have mouthful. That's that one, right? Still kind of nudie. Nudie duty. So remember, wipe it off before you put it back in the tube. Okay, then we have a brown sparkle. Brown gold sparkle, and this is so. I don't need it. 
Oh, yeah, no, that makes it worse. Oh, my gosh, I can't even read it. I don't know. But it's a brown gold sparkle. Oh, yeah. And it's sparkly. Oh, my gosh, I have so much gloss on my lips. <gasps> mm, I can feel the glossiness. Anyway. <coughs> okay. So there's that one. Right? Okay. We're going to move on to the next lip. Okay, so the next, the last, second to last lipstick is Ruler number 80, the Matte Superstay Matte Ink. I have several of these. This is my favorite color. These are amazing. like truly amazing lipsticks you can get them in the lip crayon which i also have and i love okay so now more lip glosses okay so this is the gloss in the my eyes have gone completely. Heaven's Gate. Oh, that's gorgeous. That's gorgeous over this. That really is beautiful. Like, it's stunning. I'm going to have to wear that combination more often. Yes, ma'am. That's beautiful. Okay. Then we're going to go to, this is Peach Tea. I love this one too. This is another one that I'll just wear on its own. Often. And I got it on my upper lip. So you can see it all by itself. So, like I said, I love this one. This one's one of my favorites one of my favorites i like it so much okay and then this one is a succulent again another one of my favorites it has that like iridescent -y purple shift so pretty it's so pretty a good little kiss pack her up buttercup And then the last one is Lodestar. Oh, Cody, you just pooted. Okay. So, those are all of those, those lippies. Now I have just made a mess of my thumb. Load. Okay, and I'm going to wipe this off of my face. I only have one more lippy to go and then we're done. Okay, last but very much not least, this kind of helped start my channel and this is one of my all time favorite lippies is this one right here. This is kind of like your perfect nude. It's also a dupe for the Mac, uh, oh, what is it? Something Teddy, I think. Um, it is, Mm, Maybelline's 050 Baddest Beige. This is number two for me. Just getting close to needing to be done. Um, and needing a number three. And only because I use other lippies. Oh, she's moisturizing. She's beautiful. She goes with everything. And she's super duper affordable. So there you go. That's my lippies. Sorry for the super long video. Play it on double speed. Um, I know. <laughs> I can't say that, are they? 
No, why couldn't I have said that at the beginning? Anyway, blessings to y'all. I love you so, so much. Check out the playlist down below. And see you guys later.